Hi guys, I'm currently in Georgetown, Penang. This is my second time in this beautiful city and every time I'm here, I'm on the hunt for the best street food because obviously Penang is world famous for its cuisine. I've been roaming around the city for the last few days trying to find the best places to eat, so here is my list. In no particular order, the first one is Asam Laksa. Laksa is a really popular spicy coconut noodle soup which is usually cooked with chicken, prawn or fish. Here they serve it with thick noodles, so it's fishy, spicy and tangy. The most delicious combination. Number two, Chendol. Chendol is a shaved ice dessert with fresh pandan flavored palm flour noodles, coconut milk, kidney beans and palm sugar. It might sound like a strange combination, but believe me, it's so delicious and very refreshing. You'll always find a huge queue outside of this place and it's for a good reason because they serve the most amazing chendol. Number three, nasi kandar, which is in a nutshell a steamed rice meal served with a variety of delicious Indian curries and side dishes. I love a good variety when it comes to food and nasi kandar will give you exactly that and also make sure you try the teh tarik while you're there. Number four, kuei tiao. This little place is run by a father and son and serves up the best kuei tiao in Penang. Kuei tiao is a flat rice noodle dish which is mixed with delicious special sauce, bean sprouts, chives, eggs, Chinese sausages and shrimps. It is so tasty and it's definitely worth a try. You have to get here early though and be prepared to queue. Number five is ochien aka fried oyster omelette. The texture of the omelette is soft, fluffy and juicy and the flavor is amazing especially with the spicy sauce. Number six is a dish that you can't leave Penang without trying. So nasi lemak is a Malay fragrant rice dish cooked in delicious coconut milk and pandan leaf. So it's normally served with fried anchovies, sliced cucumber, fried fish and a sweet chili sauce. Number seven is hoki and mee. These combined yellow and rice noodles with prawn are served in thick, fishy and flavorsome broth. You have the option to add pork, chili paste and egg to the mix as well based on your preference. Warning though, it is pretty spicy. Look at that red broth. Last but not least, whether you love it or hate it, you have to try durian, i.e. the king of fruit that has this really, really strong distinct smell. Durian is very hit and miss, so it's best to stay away from random street vendors and find a reputable seller for you to get the best quality and at a reasonable price. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed my little video on the best places to eat in Penang. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe for more food adventures. And thank you so much for watching.